Well, people brave the cold temperatures and snowy conditions in Salt Lake City today, celebrating the ribbon cutting of Utah's first Black History Museum. Fox 13's Diego Romo joining us live in Salt Lake City, where the museum was unveiled to the public today. Diego. Yeah, this bus houses Utah's first ever Black History Museum. It will travel to schools and community spaces across the state, bringing with it stories of Black excellence and often overlooked figures in our state's history. It is so important that, that all children learn about the Black pioneers that came here and the cowboys and the musicians, right? It's important for all kids to learn all history. Black Lives Matter Utah founder Lex Scott says the museum will give all Utahns a chance to learn a more complete history of the state. The museum is not just for children. Adults will learn from it as well. It's a, a vision that was created a couple years ago and it's taken this much time and a lot of effort to get to this, this point, this day. Liz Lampson is a museum board member and artist who contributed to the bus. I learned about a lot of historical figures that I'd never heard of before, I didn't know anything about. That just goes to show how much we need this museum. The bus features murals of black Americans who have shaped our nation's history, as well as figures from Utah's past who often get overlooked, like Jane Manning James. Jane is one of the first black women that ever came to Salt Lake City. And I think a lot of times in Utah when we think about our history, we think of pioneers, we don't necessarily think about black individuals, especially black women, and her story is very inspiring. The traveling museum contains stories, images, and artifacts of America's troubled history and mistreatment of its black citizens. But there is also a focus on the great impacts black Americans have had on our nation and world. There is so much good that that black people have contributed to our societies, to the world, and to the Utah community. <laughs> Now, the creators of the exhibit hope it will serve as a catalyst for oftentimes difficult conversations about race and racism in America and in Utah. The bus will begin traveling around the state in the coming weeks. Live in Salt Lake City, Diego Romo, Fox 13 News, Utah.